This is Ngorongoro Crater, also known as Heaven on Earth. Ngorongoro Crater is a caldera, which is a depression in the earth formed by a massive volcanic eruption. The mountain was estimated to have been around the height of Kilimanjaro, the highest peak in Africa. Now, Ngorongoro Crater is brimming with wildlife due to its natural lake and the density of the forest in and around the crater. And it's not actually considered a national park because of the presence of the Maasai tribe there. They continue to live nomadic or semi-nomadic lives, sustaining themselves as pastoralists. My main question is always, ain't they scared to live there? But I've learned that they have various tactics to stay safe, like masking their scents and more. Which I'm glad they do, because in Gordon Gordon Crater is home to the Big Five. And the Big Five are elephants, rhinos, lions, buffalo, and leopards. They're nicknamed the Big Five as they were the most dangerous to hunt. Now, right along with me as I experienced some of the best landscapes I've seen on safari, I saw one pig and was sold. My heart said, heaven is calling. Heaven on earth, that is. So, since I'm based in Arusha right now, I took a day trip with my trusty guide, Kantona. It was actually his birthday. Oh my God, it's my birthday. <laughs> we stopped for pics with views of the Great River Valley. Had a nice breakfast. Okay, so we made it to Karatu. And it's time for breakfast, so that's what we're about to do. I think I'm getting the Spanish omelette, sausage, bacon. Whatever. It's gonna be good. Thank you. Then we hit the road to start the safari. Where well, we were greeted first by baboons and then a thick misty fog as we climbed the rim of the crater. I just kept thinking, there's something in the mist. Like I'm in heaven. God rest her soul. <laughs> Finally, when we got down low enough in the crater, the clouds went away and the sun came out. And Gorongoro is stunning, breathtaking. And although I know the animals aren't all living long lives, at least they're free to grow and be in their natural habitat. Enjoy the scenes, enjoy the pics. It's unreal. So I completely understand why the tourism board here has gone with Tanzania Unforgettable as their slogan. It really is. I'll never forget my time here. No other place in the world is like it. What's up? Are you good? I'm gonna cry. <laughs>
got one right here. He just minding his business. This is the way out of the Golden Gota Crater. Welcome. <laughs> <I'm Okay? sorry. laughs> 